Alright guys, just for a quick update on this automatic four door. It's not going to be automatic for long. I'm actually going to be making it five speed today with a couple of my buddies. Um, I ended up buying a 99 EX four door that was black and I was going to build it but there was something wrong with the body, the actual frame underneath. So I completely stripped it for everything that I would need to make this car five speed. So I've already got the boot in. I've already done the pedal swaps, cluster swap on it. Um, I ordered an XTD stage three clutch, six puck. I've got the five speed computer right there. Starter, rear mount, trans with the neutral out bearing. So yeah. Um, I'm probably not going to have that much footage of it besides what you're seeing right now. If I can, because I want to get it all done in one night, I'll try to record as much as possible. But between doing this and possibly having a couple drinks, you'll probably just end up seeing the end result. But um, if you guys have any questions for those of you that are trying to do five speed um, conversions on these Hondas, just let me know. Um, I'll try to answer, you know, from my experience, what I'm going to experience today as much as possible. Alright guys, so, still here, it's about 7 o'clock at night. It's my boy Andrew right there, hooking it up with Pun. We're still working on the car, trying to get as much done as possible. Just finished disconnecting the bracket that goes across the um, transmissions like a T bracket so once we finish doing that the torque converter bolts will come off and the shift linkage once we take the shift linkage out the transmission can drop down and once the transmission comes down it's pretty much gonna be all gravy from there um, let me grab this flashlight just so I can show you something my boy Angel is a baller so here we go, show you a little something, you know, other than an automatic fucking Civic. Yeah. If you can't figure out what's going on there, then... It's a stock LS. So, you know, stock LS, papa, that's what we say. <laughs> well, there goes the car. What year is this? 13. So, 2013 SI four-door supercharged. Um couple more cars gonna be coming this way like I said before in the other clip of the video if I can I will um, record as much as possible well yeah there goes his car wife's 2016 truck and the 240 which my buddy Cole is actually probably coming tonight to pick this up and yeah we're out here fucking Doing what we can, changing the auto magic to you know a little five speed. But all right, all right. So we're still here. Haven't <laughs> gotten the transmission out because the little um part that goes around the tunnel right there on the left hand side, we can't get that out. So my buddy's angel's trying to do that right now as we speak. Hold on a second. Um, yeah, so that's what's trying to come up right now. Move your elbow for a second. All right, so if you can see that right there where the cable goes for the automatic shifter, you know, I was told that the uh, shift linkage was going to be, or the clutch pedals was going to be the hardest part. This has been the hardest part to the whole process. And the only reason we can't get this off is because not only is it riveted all the way around and spot welded, it's also glued to the tunnel. So we're trying our best to get that off right now. And that's the only thing that's stopping us from removing the transmission right now. So, yeah, we're gonna keep working on that. Oh, let's get out of here. We're gonna keep working on that. 
so we can get the tranny out and get this tranny in. I also need a new mid pipe for my car because, yeah, that low life. I tried JB Walden at one time, but I keep scraping it off. So, you know, I'm gonna get that replaced with a straight pipe on that end. And these are the wheels that might be going on the car. Some five zigging wheels. Well, we'll see. You gotta get done with this part first. So we're still trying to take off that tunnel. This is my cousin Justin right there. Trying to take that tunnel off. Um, we're still prying. Angel's down there doing his thing. It's almost out. Yeah. Was that a grunt of success? Damn near. Fucking right. Woo. There it goes. So it's out. Tranny's gonna come out right now. Show him your angry Spanish face. <laughs> yeah, so now it's time for the train to come out. So we'll get back to that one. Alright guys, so here goes the uh, five-speed swap in my 96 EK four-door. Working on the swap itself. My cousin's over here doing the wiring. Wiring over here. Couple cars out here. You can't really see them, but supercharged. Civic SI 2013. If you can see that, supercharger right there. And we got an EK hatch over here. K series. Can't really see that at all. Hold on, give me one second. Show you guys some shit. Oh, there goes my 240SX. Borrow this light real quick. Uh. Yeah, so here we go. Comtech Supercharged 2013 SI. And over here, K Series EK Hatch. What it do? What up, bitch? So it's one in the morning. We're still at it. Is it really one in the morning? Yeah, five speed trainees in. Oh, fuck. Fucking, there goes Angel. Still banging some music. This nigga Justin is sleeping in the car, waving. There you go. Chilling, man. Just waiting for you to finish up. Waiting for us to finish up. Lies. His job is the wiring, and he's done. Kind of. Not. <laughs> so, yeah, there's the auto fucking tranny. Um, yeah, so, pretty much what we have left is finish, finishing up the fucking tranny, bolting up the shift linkage, um, bleeding the clutch, connecting the five speed <laughs> computer. And for Justin to finish the wiring. So, done tonight, Angel? What? Done tonight? Nah, we still got more shit to do. No, I'm saying we're gonna be done tonight? Duh. Well, this morning? Do you wanna get technical? Yeah, yeah, we're gonna be done this morning. So, yeah. There we go. Alright. Alright, so, here it is in the morning, <clears throat> fucking sh fucked up mess here, but, so, wiring's done, shifter's done, I just have to put the, um, axles back in, put the car on the ground, or put my exhaust on, then put the car on the ground, then put the manual trans fluid in. And start her up. Alright guys, so here's the 
final result with the uh, five speed swap. As you can see there, you got your shift linkage and everything. I just had to replace that because I got drunk last night and ended up snapping an axle. Doing burnouts. It's only one way to celebrate your birthday, right? So, there goes the shift linkage. Short throw shifter. And there goes where you see that plate right there. That's the area where you gotta knock out the little tunnel where the automatic shift linkage goes. Shift is very, very, very stiff, but it's all good. Let me know if you guys have any questions on doing the actual swap. Um, all the information I got off of Heim the Tech, and it was pretty straightforward. Um, yeah. In order for your reverse lights to work, you do have to wire into this sensor right here which is on the top of the transmission is the only sensor on the manual transmission besides the speed sensor and that goes to two wires that come out of the plug right there which is what my cousin was wiring um but yeah like i said all the information is on honda tech